And it, big news with a name change to kick things off. Eight hospitals, hundreds of care sites across the state are all going to be rebranded under a different name. Mercy Health locations will now be called Trinity Health. Now, Trinity Healthcare Systems, it, that, that's, that's the parent company of Mercy mm -hmm. Health. They have been for 22 years now. The move was announced yesterday in a voice message to the community telling us unifying their brand will help assure patients that they'll receive the same level of care as was provided under the Mercy Health name. Mercy Health Muskegon was the first West Michigan branch to reveal the new signage. Replacements for the remaining locations are going to happen over the next eight months. And if you plan to travel, you're still going to need the mask up. Sorry to say, planes, trains, and buses through at least May 3rd now. The Federal Transportation Mask Mandate, which was announced back in January of 2021, was set to expire this week, but will now, or excuse me, next Monday, Monday but is now going to be extended 15 days because of an increase in COVID-19 cases in the United States. Now, this is the fifth federal mask mandate extension, and it comes despite repeated pleas from airlines and other travel industry officials to drop it, and the other restrictions should be dropped too, they say, including a coronavirus test requirement for travelers flying into the United States. We'll see. We shall see. Well, uh, you may be familiar with eggnog at Christmas, yeah. mm, but what about egg liqueur at Easter? This thick yellow drink <laughs> is made from eight egg yolks. I say no. Uh, it's a traditional Easter liqueur in Germany. Really? And the specialty holiday drink has been made since the uh, 1900s with an original recipe coming from Brazil. Now, while it's, uh, of course, a high-calorie drink, yeah. egg liqueur is becoming more popular even outside of the Easter season. Here, here's a bottle of cholesterol. Drink no. it. That does egg Ooh. liqueur? And, like, is it thick and creamy? Yeah, like, what is it? I want to know. I love eggnog. But, Ooh, I, but, that, I but that doesn't look good to me. No, <laughs> yeah, I don't ew, know that. I've never heard of that. Ew. Hey, Panera is testing a new automated way to make and serve your coffee. Here come the oh. robots. Here they come. The restaurant chain is the first one to try this new coffee system called CookRight by Miso Robotics. The product aims to eliminate manual checkups from baristas and monitor coffee brewing. Panera says the coffee urn will be monitored for volume, time, and temperature. Miso Robotics has also worked with other brands like Chipotle. So they made for Chipotle, they made a, a, a mechanic tortilla seasoner. They named what? Chip. They named them Chippy. Oh, jeez. Yeah. And Caliburger worked with White Castle for an automatic fry cook. They named him Flippy. So, I mean, if it's chippy for the chips and flippy for the burgers, wouldn't the coffee one be called sippy? I mean, are we missing, oh, are we missing something here? I was here? just gonna go with coffee because it sounds like <laughs> it, but I like Man, sippy. We should, we should all rhyme these up. Yeah, I like that, <laughs> we'll see. Well, it's time to give your garden some care. Maybe in another month or two, we need the weather to get mm -hmm. with the program. Yeah. But uh, you can celebrate National Gardening Day today. It's a day to set aside to encourage both gardeners and would-be gardeners to pick up a shovel and plant some seeds. Maybe you can just clean up your garden today. Now, promoters of the day is say it's a call of action to get out and plant your flowers and vegetable gardens and you don't need to have a ton of space. You can plant even containers or flower boxes if you don't have a yard. Now put your skills to the test and share them with others on social media to celebrate. Yeah, we've been trying to discuss what we're gonna put in our garden. Yeah. We have three garden boxes out back. Okay, and so do we, we I have a like, yeah. tiered thing. Yeah, so and, and last year we had like hundreds and hundreds, maybe even thousands of cherry tomatoes. Ooh, it went crazy. It, nice. was, it was, we were giving them bags of them away. I love that. So when can I start planting these again? Mm, any planting, flowers, everything. Mother's Day is a good like right. key of wait till after that. All right. So yeah. Because I did see that we're gonna get chilly again. We are.